Hey, what's up, guys? This is Cops checking our public servants. I want to make this quick video to give my perspective on what the coronavirus actually is and what I think is doing right now to the people. Um, of course, I am not an expert on viruses, nor am I an expert on chakras, <clears throat> but throughout my time on here on this earth I've picked up a couple of things I've studied a couple of things and um, this is my take on the coronavirus first we will do a translation of corona from Spanish to English and we get crown next we will do a Google search for the definition of virus we'll see that it's an infective agent we'll go down a harmful or corrupting influence and number two is good because their brain is basically a computer you know we um we only output what we're input so a piece of code which is capable of copying itself and typically has a detrimental effect such as corrupting the system or destroying data The Eastern spiritual schools teach of seven chakras. Chakras can be imagined as energy points which regulate the energy in certain parts of the body. These points are arranged vertically along the axial channel. There are seven chakras. Um, I will touch on most of them but we will be focusing on one. I'll start with the sacral chakra. The sacral chakra is associated with your emotional body, creativity, and sensuality. Next, we move up to the solar plexus chakra, which helps grow your confidence and vitality connected with the energy from the foods we consume. Next is the heart chakra. The heart chakra is the center of higher emotions such as kindness, patience, joy, peace, caring, and empathy. And we have the throat chakra, which is guided by the principle of communication and expression. Then finally, it brings us to the crown. It is the energy center of universal knowledge and spiritualism, which connects you to the divine. The crown chakra influences the brain and the nervous system as well as the emotions and the level of understanding and enlightenment. If this seventh chakra, this crown chakra is balanced, you feel spiritual, blessed, unity, wisdom, open-minded, peaceful, connected to universe, strong nervous system. And if unbalanced, you feel mental disorders, fear, materialistic memory and learning problems, apathy, broken, spiritual crisis. Some symptoms of blockage would be isolation and loneliness, inability to connect with others, lack of direction, inability to set or maintain goals, feeling disconnected spiritually, neurological disorders, nerve pain, thyroid and pineal gland disorders, Alzheimer's, reoccurring headaches and migraines, schizophrenia, insomnia, depression. Now this is where it all comes together guys. The biggest causes of clogging of chakras are stress and anxiety. These create permanent tightness in the body's tissue and restricts the flow of energy. They also prevent the mind from focusing peacefully, meditating on the movement of energy through the body. So in conclusion, my opinion that this coronavirus is exactly that. It's a virus on our crown chakra. It's a crown virus. So please, guys, be considerate of your crown chakra. Do not be taken down with anxiety and fear and depression. Your 
crown chakra is very important. All our sh- crown chakras are very important and it connects to the unity of us all. All right, guys, peace.